I'll be teaching how to make a working ladder. Begin by adding a ladder prop and moving it into place. Select the block tool and create a new mesh that surrounds your ladder. Extend the top of your mesh to rise above your ladder by about 40 units. This is so players at the top of the ladder can still interact with it. Change the mesh's material to the tool trigger texture. Press Ctrl T to turn the mesh into an entity and double click it to open its properties. Change its class to a trigger traversal modifier. In the viewport two markers should have appeared labelled top and bottom. These tell the game where to position the player after they've used the ladder. Move them into place at the top and bottom of your ladder. Don't have them too close to the ladder else the player might accidentally climb the ladder again after using it. This ladder will work for players that use teleport movement, but for players that use continuous movement we need to add hand interactions as well. Place a new entity and change its class to a prop hand pose. Open the model browser and search for hand pose. Select the one called grab pole. Now place it at the end of one of the rungs on your ladder. Press Alt Enter to open its properties again and go to Extent. Edit the Extent field so that the marker in the viewport is on the other end of the rung. You can also move the marker itself in the viewport. This lets the player grab anywhere along the rung. Place these hand poses on every rung that a player could grab. You can do this quickly by holding Shift and moving them to create duplicates. This allows players to use the ladder simply by grabbing one of the rungs. Now you can create functional ladders.